Assuming that we clear out the lines, the most entrancing star I perceive is the star that could stun in our sky. It is this one, Scarab Juice or Scarab Crush. It's a red, exceptionally immense star. Moreover, on the unclear chance that you put it where the sun is, it would loosen up to the circle of Jupiter. It's enormous, totally eccentric, and going to detonate. It's not quite as clear as it gives off an impression of being in the universe. These Goliath events, like the most unreasonably dreaded massive starbursts, could shake all that we see. Also, do whatever it takes not to see its center. Bugju has been viewed as a sign, a red, very Goliath star that is ordinarily more huge than our sun. Brian Cox and other space experts figure it could go supernova, which has made individuals terrified about what will happen next. The James Webb Space Telescope is taking stunning photos of the star, raising the topic of when Betelgeuse will transform into a supernova and what titanic influence it will have on Earth. How about we sort out the star and the heavenly body Orion that sparkles so splendidly that, indeed, even people from quite a while ago have seen it. The grand star, Betelgeuse, is arranged on the eastern shoulder of the heavenly body Orion. It is the second largest star in the star group, and its name comes from this component, the beast shoulder. It is possibly one of the most splendid stars in the evening sky. On top of being very splendid, the star is additionally an odd shade of red, which, as we will see, suggests inconvenience. We've had some gigantic involvement with scarab juice for a really long time. A Greek spectator named TMY likewise centered around it. Around that time, the primary thing individuals saw about stars was their variety, and TMY said that it was a frogstool colored orange. In current times, experts have been zeroing in on the star all the more enthusiastically, and presently they have a splendid thought of what works everything out. Inquisitively, one of these characteristics is that the star changes brightness a great deal with an unmistakable size of 0.6. Betelgeuse is a variable star, which means that its brightness changes over time. As of late, experts have found some new data about the star. In 2019, experts first saw that Betelgeuse was acting whimsically. Even though Betelgeuse didn't totally quit shining, it wasn't the same. It had turned out to be impressively less brilliant, sparkling at a degree of 1.6. Experts immediately started to research why they were seeing the 10th most brilliant star act in this whimsical way. Specialists predicted to offer a shocking clarification in light of their exploration, which revealed uncommon signs from the star. As per their revelations, Betelgeuse could go supernova at any second. Brian Cox, a well-known researcher, shared this shockingly hazardous clarification. As a recognized teacher of molecule material science at the University of Manchester School of Physics and Cosmology, you shouldn't excuse his perspective as a joke. He likewise has a science show, writes famous science books, and is the Royal Society Professor for Public Engagement with Science. Brian Cox says that Betelgeuse is, by all appearances, a ticking postponed bomb, since it could go off without advance notice. To deteriorate the situation, the James Webb Space Telescope has shown an amazing measure of proof to back up this clarification. But what unusual signs has Betelgeuse shown that have caused so much worry in space science? With the new data about Bugju, the star has been named a supernova up in Comer. Regardless of the way that examiners are still uncertain when it will detonate, the reality that Bugju is twice the mass of the Sun is one explanation for this. Grouping a star, as it's been said, should be a couple of times the mass of the sun to be known as a supernova. Things get genuinely intriguing, anyway, in light of the fact that experts have utilized various instruments to investigate creepy crawly Jew, like the James Webb Space Telescope and the Laser Interferometer Gravitational Wave Observatory, to see what's going on in space around Betelgeuse. What they found is still a secret. It was brought into the world on August 31st, quite a while in the past. Around that time, the star Scarab Squeeze clearly advertised odd clues that made its future unsure. What did they find? Well, they could identify inquisitive light waves coming from the star or from bug juice, which is extremely inquisitive. Anyway, it wasn't the only thing specialists saw from the star. This returns us to the probability that Betelgeuse is a star whose brightness changes sometimes. It was said that disturbing Betelgeuse obscured down at standard stretches and had dim spots, similar to our sun today. Anyway, the conditions are unique. 
It changes from brilliant to dim two times as quick as it used to, which is another marker. It has gotten back to an astounding sign that Beetlejuice's experts saw. The star's diminishing cycle had hit a band of nature of 1.61 in February 2021. This was not long after the massive obscuring event. Survey how the star seemed to fade in a peculiar way in 2019. That is on the grounds that it's presently known as the phenomenal obscuring. We could see that the mind-boggling obscuring was the beginning of Betelgeuse's strange way of behaving, which made many individuals stress that Betelgeuse planned to detonate. The scope of obscuring was 1.2, somewhere between 2019 and 2020, and the most diminished level of darkening ever recorded was in 2019. So experts were sure that horrendous bug juice would go supernova in the following 100,000 years, in perspective of the remarkable obscuring. There is a part occurring in the universe, so this is really amazing. Investigators immediately changed their viewpoints. Anyway, when they saw what occurred next, Betelgeuse got brighter again after the extraordinary diminishing, and it changed into something undeniably more striking. Astrophysicist Andrea Dupree at the Harvard-Smithsonian Center for Astronomy says that the star is presently 150% more brilliant than ordinary, making it the seventh most brilliant star. Above experts were terrified when they saw a red gleam in the southern piece of the sky. Today, it still gets really intriguing since this has prompted unique contemplations about what caused the mind-boggling obscuring. First, it's essential to take note of that not all stars have the red sparkle of insect squeeze. The red sparkle of insect dew implies that it's a red very giant star, which is the last phase of a star's life and death. The red gleam, on the other hand, is brought about by a surface temperature of around 3,500 Kelvin, which is a lot cooler than the external layer of the sun, which is 5,500 Kelvin. Since insect juice is cooler than our sun, it radiates less energy per unit of surface region. All things considered, it is more enormous and will explode. Now, let's look at what the exceptional obscuring looked like. Brian Cox asks, does it genuinely mean that insect juice will go supernova? As a result, the fact that Betelgeuse is a red, very giant star shows that it is close to the furthest limit of its life as a star. A star that is kicking the bucket will likewise habitually debilitate over time, which is something experts get. Anyway, Betelgeuse's new astounding way of behaving has made specialists concentrate all the more seriously. Furthermore, numerous telescopes are presently zeroing in on the exceptional obscuring. Still, Things get considerably more fascinating in light of the fact that specialists don't have a huge comprehension of creepy crawly juice. Researchers are presently utilizing the most cutting-edge devices to watch out for the dazzling things occurring around Betelgeuse. The James Webb Space Telescope has been, quite possibly, one of the best instruments. Examiners have utilized such a long way, beginning around 2021. The James Webb Space Telescope has been in space, and has assisted examiners with gathering a part of huge information about Betelgeuse. The new photos of Betelgeuse's astounding obscuring, taken by this telescope, have shown that the occasion caused a colossal mass delivery. In light of new examination, we now realize that this mass send-off was multiple times bigger than a commonplace coronal mass discharge. The James Webb Space Telescope can likewise look at things our eyes can't see, like light waves and frequencies. Along these lines, researchers are amped up for what the telescope will find. Researchers have seen dust mists forming on the star's surface that seem to look like leaves in space. That doesn't appear to check out, yet in spite of the way that Betelgeuse will pass on, experts are still paying attention to it since they don't have the foggiest idea when it will go supernova. Researchers believe that Betelgeuse is normally more enormous than the sun and that the splendid red star will shine for the next 10 years. However, if we look at the numerous novel things occurring with the star, it's difficult to say if this assertion will still be valid after the amazing darkening. So, experts don't anticipate Betelgeuse to detonate at any point in the near future. If Betelgeuse explodes, it will be the first cosmic explosion we saw with our own eyes since Johannes Kepler did in 1604. Specialists likewise don't think this should happen soon because they are still zeroing in on the star's uncommon way of behaving not enduring the way that Betelgeuse will make. Specialists are certain when precisely it will happen, but that remains confidential. If we separate the universe without bias, 
Potentially one of the most captivating stars and perhaps the most amazing in our sky is Betelgeuse. As frequently is not referred to as insect juice, this red giant star, if placed where the sun is, would loosen up to Jupiter's orbit. This stunningly colossal star is on the edge of an impact. The universe doesn't work in such direct terms. Strange, vainglorious events like infinite blast occasions can possibly completely upend our viewpoint. An event like this may almost certainly happen. Anyway, while the chance of Betelgeuse going supernova looms, analysts are still working to sort out the specific course of events for its end. As examiners continue to gather information from the most advanced space telescopes, such as the James Webb Space Telescope and the Hubble Space Telescope, they remain cautious about predicting an impending impact despite the star's astonishing way of behaving, including the amazing darkening and lighting up cycles. There's no certainty about when Betelgeuse will finally reach the end of its life. Some guess that it could still require countless years before the star detonates, but others believe it could happen much sooner, maybe within the next couple of years or even months. The excellent information gathered by these powerful telescopes, along with the star's unconventional way of behaving, has kept specialists restless. They are cautiously observing what is happening, utilizing each tool at their disposal to detect any subtle changes that could indicate a supernova is on the way. When Betelgeuse does finally explode, it will send shock waves through the universe, delivering a monstrous amount of energy. The blast will briefly dominate the whole universe, visible even from Earth, as brilliant as the full moon. While this event will be a radiant vast presentation, it won't present an immediate danger to Earth, as the star is found in excess of 600 light-years away. However, the cosmic explosion will give a critical opportunity for specialists to study the last phases of an enormous star's life and the peculiarities related to such a violent event. Betelgeuse's looming end isn't just a scientific interest. It's a sign of the limitlessness and peculiarity of the universe. Stars like Betelgeuse play a crucial role in the life cycle of galaxies, enriching the universe with the elements necessary for new stars, planets, and possibly life itself. The death of such a star isn't an end, but rather a transformation as it releases heavy elements that will ultimately seed new stellar systems. In the meantime, researchers continue to observe Betelgeuse and its behavior, unraveling the mystery of its future with each new discovery. The mystery grows, and our understanding of the universe expands. Perhaps soon we will witness one of the most extraordinary events in the universe. Betelgeuse's transformation from a massive red giant into an astounding supernova. Until then, the sky will remain a canvas of wonder, with Betelgeuse shining brightly, an image of the transient nature of life in the universe. As we continue to observe Betelgeuse, the mystery surrounding its fate deepens. Space researchers are particularly focused on the way that this star is moving toward the end of its life cycle and its unpredictable behavior. The fact that something is causing it to act so strangely is generating great interest. It's important to remember that supernovae are not the final stage for all stars. For example, smaller stars like our Sun will end their lives in a much more settled way, shedding their outer layers and leaving behind a white dwarf. However, Betelgeuse is a massive red supergiant, and that means that when it dies, it will go out with a spectacular bang, totally different from the slow darkening of smaller stars. The sheer size of Betelgeuse makes it an intriguing subject for study. With a radius several times bigger than the Sun, if it were placed at the center of our solar system, it would stretch beyond the orbit of Mars. This gives you a sense of how large it is compared to the Sun, which is already a giant by the standards of most stars. The size of Betelgeuse means that it has consumed massive amounts of fuel throughout its life. As it approaches the end of its life, its core is rapidly collapsing under the force of gravity. This collapse is what eventually triggers the violent blast of a supernova. The process leading up to the explosion of Betelgeuse is complex. As it nears supernova status, the core of the star begins to contract and heat up, while its outer layers expand and cool. This creates an unstable environment with periodic changes in brightness. These changes in brightness, like the darkening event observed in 2019, are signs that the star is entering a phase of rapid transformation. This dimming may be related to a massive outflow of material from the star's surface, which temporarily clouds its light. Despite these variations, Betelgeuse continues to emit light, though inconsistently, 
making it a fascinating object for study. The possibility that Betelgeuse might be a candidate for a nearby supernova has drawn the attention of space agencies and scientists worldwide. With current instruments like the James Webb Space Telescope and the Hubble Space Telescope, researchers are collecting a wealth of information on the star. These telescopes allow us to observe Betelgeuse in frequencies that were previously out of reach, such as infrared and ultraviolet light, providing insights into the star's internal processes. Furthermore, scientists are using advanced models to simulate the behavior of massive stars like Betelgeuse. These models help researchers predict the star's future behavior and estimate the timeline for when it will explode. While the exact timing of Betelgeuse's supernova remains uncertain, the current data suggests that it could happen sooner rather than later. Some forecasts indicate that the explosion could occur within the next few years, while others speculate that it could take a few thousand years. Regardless of the timeline, Betelgeuse's impending death will undoubtedly be a milestone event in the study of stellar evolution. Even though the explosion of Betelgeuse won't pose an immediate threat to Earth, it will still offer scientists a valuable opportunity to study the final moments of a massive star's life. By witnessing this event, astronomers will gain a deeper understanding of how massive stars die and what happens when they go supernova. The remnants of the explosion will provide new elements and materials that will enrich the interstellar medium, contributing to the formation of new stars and planets. In the end, Betelgeuse isn't just a star that is disappearing. It's a cosmic clock ticking down to a magnificent event. As researchers continue to observe this giant of the night sky, we are reminded of the wonders of the universe and the delicate balance that governs the lives of stars. Whether today, tomorrow, or millennia from now, when Betelgeuse finally reaches the end of its life, it will leave a legacy that will shape the universe for billions of years to come.